하고 싶어 주맡기고 싶고 이런 시간들이 모여 피어나나 싶어 이어폰을 꼈어 보면서 나 봤던 우주 비행하고 싶어 멀미하게 삼켜 Hi friends, so today's video, as you can see from the title, it is going to be a DIY. It has been so long since I last made one, but you know, I wanted to make one today, so here we are. But yeah, today's video is TikTok inspired because y'all know, if y'all don't follow me on TikTok already, make sure to do so. <laughs> Love that shameless self promo. Anyways, I just keep seeing this trend of like the Spotify glass art DIY. So I was like, why not try it out? So yeah, that is going to be today's DIY. And for most part, it ended up looking cute. I wish I had like a Cricut printer because a bunch of the DIYs that I've seen have been using Cricut printers for like the text and stuff, but uh, I don't have the money for that. So yeah, we're not gonna do that. So I just ended up using some paint markers and I feel like it still turned out pretty good. So if you guys wanna see how I made it, please keep on watching. But yeah, I, that is going to be today's DIY and we should just get straight on into it. So let's do it. <laughs> All right, so for the DIY, you're gonna be needing some type of glass and I actually used this from an old photo frame, some sticker paper and some white paint marker. So the first thing would be to use or find a Spotify song that you would like to use. So I just basically opened up Spotify and just decided to see which song I was feeling. And I chose Zero O'Clock because that song is so good. But basically all you're gonna do, well this part is optional, but you could go ahead and save the music code so you can add it onto your Glass DIY. But I ended up not using it, so yeah. But anyways, as you can see here, I'm gonna go ahead and screenshot the screen so that I can go ahead and save the music controls and just go ahead and just crop it just so the music controls are the only ones showing and once you've cropped it go ahead and save it to your gallery and then if you have an iPhone you can go ahead and just airdrop it to your computer and print it out. The next step would be to find some album art of your choice so I just basically went on to Google and just searched whatever I want. I chose Map of the Soul 7 album cover and they have a wide range of stuff to choose from but to define my search I ended up looking at the tools and looking for like high quality images and I ended up finding and using the actual album cover so I went ahead and just saved that but if you're going to be using an image that isn't cropped how you would like it go ahead and save the image first and then through Photoscape I ended up cropping it using the one by one tool for cropping and go ahead and save it like so and it should be cropped and after that go ahead and print it onto your sticker paper. Once you printed it out and as you can see I ended up printing out two just in case if I messed up on the other one but go ahead and cut it out like so and depending on the sticker paper that you have mine was easily able to peel off but I will go ahead and link the one that I bought down below. Basically once you peeled it off go ahead and place it onto the glass like so and it should look something like this. So now with the music controls and you also wanted to print this out, I did not mention it earlier, but yeah, go ahead and print it out. And with the washi tape, I went ahead and taped it onto the back just so I know where to draw everything once I start using my paint marker. But as you can see here, I'm gonna go ahead and start tracing everything onto the front of the glass just so it starts looking like how it is on the screenshot and i accidentally messed up or i messed up actually so many times on this thing but i think it still turned out okay um yeah as you can see the letters were not in the same place as the one printed but you know what it is what it is but i ended up using a finer tip paint marker just to get the finer details and the numbers and also the symbols as well but basically what you're going to be doing is just transferring everything that is on the screenshot onto the glass like so and basically once you are done tracing everything go ahead and start peeling it off and yeah for most part it ended up looking real nice i wish i had a cricut printer to like make it more like precise and everything but you know i still liked how it turned out but basically this is what it ended up looking like and i'm honestly not mad at it like it honestly looks really cute so yeah but that is the diy and yeah <laughs> All right.
right guys so that is the end of the diy i hope that you guys enjoyed it if you guys do end up recreating it please do tag me on your social medias i would love to see it if you guys have any other tiktok diys you would want me to do like k-pop inspired i guess please do let me know in the comments down below because i'm trying to get back on that diy grind for y'all so yeah but i hope that you guys enjoyed it and i will just see you guys again soon make sure to follow me on my social medias it's TikTok inspired, so follow me on TikTok. <laughs> I love you guys so, so much, and I hope that you all are staying safe. I will just see you guys again soon with another video. So, bye guys. I fell in love in spring. Have loved you like summer. Got her on again. It's all. Get out of our first winter.